Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. For this video for today, it's gonna be a little story time about when I met Christian Kostov. Yes, you heard it, I met him. I am such a huge fan of him. <laughs> Sorry, I got my hair all over my face. I am such a huge fan of him and I finally got the chance to meet him and yes, I'm gonna tell you everything about So if you wanna see that, then please keep watching. Okay, so the first thing you may be wondering how the hell did you meet him? Well, my friend Ann and I already knew that he was coming to um, Groningen, a, a town in Holland, for the EBBA Awards. Um, so we were really excited, like, oh my god, he's coming here, but we didn't think we would actually meet him. We went there, he tweeted like, yeah, if you want to come meet me, come meet me at my hotel and blah, 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 details come later. So Ann and I were like freaking out, we thought like, Oh my god, we have to go. This is our only chance. I traveled four hours, this far, four hours to be there. And then he said, yeah, I'll be around there at eight. Well, we were waiting at the hotel. Uh, we go up to the lobby or what we thought was the lobby. So we went up there, asked the people like, yeah, can we wait here? Because we're waiting for Christian and, and Fen meeting, blah, 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 all of that. I explained it everything. I felt so awkward, but I had to do it. And then those workers said like, oh, we don't know anything about a fan meeting. We were like, oh, okay. But they said like, yeah, you can wait here. So I think what they did was calling the manager from Christian. So um, then Chris went live and um, he said something about, what did he say again? Oh, I have a fish memory. He said, like, don't bother the workers there. Uh, he didn't expect people actually to come to the hotel to meet him. And I thought, like, okay, well, Chris, we are here to meet you. I didn't come for nothing. So he said, like, yeah, wait on zero, uh, the zero level. So we went down to the zero level and waited there. And then he tweeted, like, 20 minutes, I'm on my way. And we were, like, freaking out. Harker, we were like, ah, he's almost gonna be here. And oh, then... We were like, I was like jumping around the hall because I was so excited. I was like shaking. It was bad, but it was so worth it. Um, then Chris finally came, like the doors opened and he was on and I made a little squeak. I was, Here comes the clip that he came through the door and we met. It was the most amazing thing ever. It makes me cry every time I watch it. So enjoy this little clip of him coming through the door. He gave us a group hug and then he laid his jacket down. We went made pictures like this one and this one. Um, I also made a picture with his brother Daniel right here. Uh, so it was really amazing. He was like the sweetest person I've ever met. Uh, oh my god, words can't even describe how sweet he is. Like. I asked him something to say to my vlog, so I'll play the clip right here and we'll talk about it. <laughs> I is who I is. My name is Christian Gustav and this young lady is such a precious person to me. She came from... Uh, the the elder. elder. <laughs> Whatever. <A long> way. <laughs> yes, I cannot say that. And I'm super happy to meet her in person and yeah, just share some love with her because oh she's amazing. Oh my god. So that clip really was truly the best clip I ever recorded for my vlog and I didn't know what to do on the video like laugh cry like my facial expression I think said enough because I didn't know what to think and I was like holy shit what is he saying <laughs> so he is the sweetest person I've ever met like I knew he was sweet because of course I'm a huge fan I'm part of team Chris guys but in person he's even more amazing than you would think he's oh you can really laugh at him feel like giving um, him our presents um he was like oh my god and then he got all of us to the screen because he went live on his um, account too I'll show the clip right here oh, thank you. Hey! 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 
So that was of him going live with us. He um, actually choked me a little when he was hugging us for the live, but <laughs> it's okay. I didn't mind. I hugged him or he hugged me. And um, then he we like opened the presents and everything. He got every each and one of us in screen and I have my charger in my bag. <laughs> it was so stupid. I put it in there like in the afternoon. I forgot to take it out. So he was looking at it. I said, oh, that's my charger. And he, went in and he was talking about something about my shoes that they looked so clean. And then he showed his shoes like, yeah, I ruined them all. And I then like, no, no, just not that bad. And <laughs> what did he say? I have to, I have to. Um. He also said something. I was wearing my Christian. And he said like, I love the life. He was like, yeah, and she's my jacket. And then he said like, yeah, people should pay me money for that. And then I was like, God, I had to laugh so hard. Oh God, she. But he's just so funny and the sweetest. His brother too, like Daniel. When I asked him to go on a picture with me, he said like, yeah, yeah, sure, I would love that. And he told us about that. He just got a new haircut and everything. <laughs> it was so funny. So it was really great. The meeting lasted like 20 minutes, I think. It felt way longer, but then you can really feel that we were so close together. Like there were only six persons, like Anna, me, and my best friend Alyssa, who I also met for the first time. It was amazing. And there were um, three other people. Um, and we were just also close. It really felt like tight family. So it's crazy. Like, ah. I'm sorry if this video is like messy and all over the place, but I just can't explain the feeling I'm having. I just, I just can't freaking explain the feeling, okay guys? So sorry for that. I just, I don't have words for everything. I can't tell you everything. And I also got this. Wait, wait, hold up a moment. I'm gonna get it. I also got his freaking autograph. Look at that, guys. Oh my lord. Yes, I framed it. Don't judge me. I framed it. Really clumsy. So I thought if I'm not gonna frame it, I will rip it. So I thought why not just frame it and put it in my closet. I'm also gonna frame another picture. Oh my hell, where's my, oh, I found my phone. <laughs> I'm also gonna frame in another picture, but I don't know yet. And we also made some group pictures. I'll pop them up right here. So that was it for the meeting. And then it was time for Christian to leave. And um, it was really emotional. I felt emotional because Chris is such a huge part of my life because it changed my life completely because I got a lot of friends through Instagram and everything. <clears throat> so standing in the back, I was standing right next to Daniel, his brother, and I was crying a little because I knew he was about to go, so I was crying. He said, like, Daniel said, like, Hey, are, are you okay? I said, yeah, no, no, I'm fine. And then Chris came walking up to me and said like, oh no, don't cry, don't cry, and gave me a hug. 
why I um, even cried more because <laughs> the hug was the hug was good. <laughs> no, um, step into the elevator, and we said our goodbyes, and I will roll the clip right here. Bye, Chris. Bye. Bye. We love you. Bye bye. Say bye. that would be a super awkward moment when I'm <laughs> waiting for the. Party. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. Literally. I've already said bye. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now bye for. We have to put the music. Bye. 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 We love you. <laughs> we love you. Bye bye. Yes. <laughs> bye. Bye. So you saw that little clip, and after that, Aunt and I went walking from the hospital to the bus station because we course had to get back home and then he went live while we were, we we're walking away from the hotel and what he said there was the most amazing thing I think that you just you just gotta watch it I rolled the clip right here so hey um I just I'm really speechless and um uh, I just wanted to tell you that I've probably never felt that good ever in my life. Um, I'm here in the Netherlands and people came here from Germany and from other cities of the Netherlands or Holland just to see me and they were so happy. They were smiling and laughing and we were having such an amazing time. and. I think that's it. That's just, that's what I want to do. That's, that's the, that's everything. That's really everything. It means everything to me and to my team. And I just want to say one more time that I'm absolutely grateful for your support and for everything that you've been doing for me since, since the beginning. Not since Eurovision, since Sex Factor, since The Voice, since ever. And, it's just been an amazing journey and yeah, tomorrow is a big day. Just want to say thank you for everything and yeah, that's it, kind of. I'm still kind of shocked because I really wasn't expecting that. So yeah, love you guys and have a good night. Bye. So yes, it was really emotional, it was really deep, so such a way that he talked about it did really much to me like you could really see when he came first came into the door like he was smiling as well like he said that we were smiling but he was smiling too and he I think he's always really happy when he gets a chance to meet a like fans from Team Chris you know who are part of the family who are supporting him and everything so you could really see that he was happy too and that message that message was amazing, so yes, and then it was done, it was over, and now I only have videos to watch back like hundreds of times. That's it. Now, moving on, the EBBA Awards. Guys, if you are part of Team Chris, please comment it down below, like comment hashtag Team Chris with a triangle, and I'll know you're part of the family. But moving on, if you guys are part of Team Chris, and you already know this. He freaking won an EBBA award. That was why he was coming. But he also won like the um, the main EBBA award for like the, the whole year and everything. That was the greatest moment of my life. I was watching it on my laptop. And they said like, okay, and the winner is Christian Kossoff. And I banged on the table. <laughs> oh God, I was too excited. So I think that was everything. Was that everything? I think it was still can't believe it actually happened I just it still blows my mind away this was the video guys I hope you liked this little story time with me if you did please smash the like button and also be sure to subscribe if you're new and turn on notifications so you get notified every time I upload um, and leave me some suggestions in the comments down below what videos you would like to see on my channel. So go do those things and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!